pray, Father, that you protect us, Father. We pray, Father, that you give us life. There are so many times I wanted to commit suicide, there are so many times I wanted to die. It was very really sad. I was alone. I cannot imagine another person going through what I went through. For those who left us, Viva the trans community! Viva! Viva! I was born here. A land with beautiful mountains and deep dark forests, home to wild animals like the golden lion and elephant grey. A country place with diversity in ethnicity, gender, flora, fauna. Yet in all this richness, as a people and as a nation, we still struggle to recognize and appreciate this diversity. Instead, our people have left all this for dead. of anti-gay protesters demonstrate in Jinja, Uganda in support of a bill proposing life imprisonment for homosexuals. We shall have a war with the homosexual lobby in the world. Just a day after the controversial anti-gay bill was signed into law, headlines such as this one which reads exposed on a newspaper in Uganda called Red Pepper hit the streets. Uganda's 200 top homos named. On Friday of the week that bill was passed, I was on the front page of the red paper. I officially lost my job and several my family friends, fearing for their safety abandoned me. For the past month and a half, we have been living behind a closed gate, closed windows, keeping on a very down low. People go hungry for days, and if the mom doesn't get them, the hunger and the lack of access to antiretrovirus will surely kill them. I guess you're also, you're also going to ask him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So do you have to look in the camera? No, you look at the looking okay. at the camera. Okay. okay. I met Nelly through high school. He was reluctant because he wasn't sure what he was feeling because he knew he wasn't gay, he knew he was into girls, but he really didn't know why he was um, feeling this way towards me. So yeah, we met again this year. Uh, I was signed out with my girls and then who do I see? It was nearly just across the table with his friends. And I look at this person and he seems so familiar, but I'm like, would it be him? But then he's looking at someone who looks different. So I look at him and then I say, Nelly. And then he's like, yeah. Him saying that I had transitioned made it seem easier for us to actually start a relationship. homosexuality is a human right but also we need to appreciate the fact that it is not a human right across across the world and certainly in Uganda we don't take it as a human right I've been attacked more than once what happens is that you lose self-esteem, you get depressed, you lose confidence and you're basically a dead person living, waiting to actually die. I've always known like Thailand is the heaven for transgender people, they are fully accepted, they have this nice 
relatively cheap daughters that you can go for transitioning for having surgery and all that in as much as i'm making plans for it i'm still trying to wrap my fingers around it i'm still trying to accept it